today, ladies and gentlemen. You're looking at InnoVice's InfoSwim, InfoSwim 2D, and InfoSwim Sustain, tools that we've developed to help you better plan and customize the future for your citizens. Our tools are part of ArcGIS, extension in ArcGIS. Our tools have built-in uh, controls for making uh, data. We have ArcGIS Gateway. We have Domain Manager. We have a Facility Manager for making smaller models out of big, bigger models. We have a database editor, a fantastic database editor, allows you to edit data, graph data, uh, and do statistical comparisons of the data with other data. We also have um, a run manager, which does sophisticated 1D and 2D uh, modeling for up to a thousand years. We also have a report model where you can graph all of the 2D and 1D data, including water quality over time. We also have a statistics manager where it allows you to do the statistics for your continuous simulation, for your long-term or short-term continuous simulation. Because as part of Esri, we also have a, the, the ability to use our toolbox. You can append data, you can dissolve data, you can do buffering, you can bring in your buildings as a layer and then buffer or dissolve and make 2D polygons by appending it to the 2D polygons. When you run your model, you get a quick maximum depth this display. So this quickly shows you where the flooding occurs in your model. We also have map display where you can show the map display of the 1D modeling flooding. So you're allowed to customize and build better models. In addition, we have an animation viewer which allows you to see the animation of the flow over time very fast. This is a whole day simulation. You can see the, uh, the flooding and the arrows on the, on the model. In addition, we also have a very good climate change model you can, you can predict the um, you can predict using the swim cat from EPA the changing uh, temperature evaporation rainfall over time and simulate in, in your continuous simulation we also have linked groundwater models so if you have a BMP or LID at a storage node or etc it can link to the groundwater and you can model recharge LID is fantastic you can model green roofs you can model porous pavements you can model other features on the, on, the, on the system and, and have them um, simulate um, and, and graph. So we can use that in the report graph. In addition, we have our InfoSwim Sustain, which allows you to do um, basically siting. Using the GIS data, you can site your, your basins, your constructed wetlands, your bioretention, sand filter, rain barrel, cistern, wet pond, dry pond, grass swell, infiltration trends, vegetative filter strip green roof, forest pavement, all these different features, bringing in data from the GIS. So you bring in the data, the model cites that, and on top of that, it does the, um, it does the optimization. It runs the model based on your goals and tells you what the answer is. Not only does it tell you what the answer is, it tells you what the answer is of all the uh, features that found in this genetic algorithm. It tells you in yellow what that is. The green are the uh, the optimal solutions. You look at those optimal solutions and you pick what you want to want to find, what to want to use in a model. The rules are you use customization. So you design, you design a report. You get five possible answers. You can then look at how that um, feature worked over time for for the various solutions, and you can actually graph the before and after. So you can see in yellow that that the, uh, the water quality and the runoff has been reduced using this LID. You then apply it to InfoSwim and then you lessen your 2D, run, 2D flooding and have a better model and um, better prediction of what's happening in the future. So these are some of the tools that InnoVice provides to you. InfoSwim, InfoSwim 2D, with our, all, of, all of our tools for making and building and analyzing, graphing the model, along with InfoSwim Sustain to make better green infrastructure solutions for you, your city, and the citizens of your city. Thank you very much for listening, and I appreciate the time.